It's time for another Lessons with Dan, presented by the Village Golf Club 122 Country Club Drive in Royal Palm Beach, Florida. Today's lesson, setting up to the target for the best possible swing motion. Let's go out to the course. Okay, next one we're going to do is weight, Carl. We're going to put yourself in position, and you're going to try to feel your weight on the balls of your feet here. Too many people sit on their heels. And the other thing that they do is they put their they put their feet down first before they put the club head in position to where they'd like to send the ball. So what's very important here is that you understand how you are placing your club head, setting your hands on the grip, and then setting your weight and your posture. So this is key if you want to have a good balanced swing. Good, good weight on the balls of the feet, over the ball, your arms hanging. From here, you can create the best swing, balanced swing that you can produce. What we want to do and, and what we want to become very, very sensitive to is A, please, please take the time not to look and then put your feet. Please take your time to look at, at your target, look where you want to send the ball, focus on that, then place your face with your right hand of the club in that direction, then put your grip and then set up correctly. And four irons and hybrids, the ball position should be the middle of your feet. Not behind, not forward. Now, as we go to the fairway clubs, five wood, uh, five metal, three metal, one metal, same thing. Always look, look to your target, always determine with your club head that area where you'd like to send it. Take your grip and then move into your shot. And again here, ball position, I'd say two inches inside your left heel if you're right-handed, two inches inside your right heel if you're, if you're uh, left-handed. So it's very, very key. Always a little bit of an angle. Never behind straight like this because you see how you create a curvature here plus you're going to pick up the club too quickly with your hands and you're going to throw it down. You want to let your club be pushed back and given maximum hand, arm, shoulder, and body. Those are the keys to initiate the best swing. We only have a second and a half to execute a golf swing, so it's very, very important for you to realize that we can't think of all these things. We can only allow them to start. The last thing on that that I want to emphasize, do not grab the club. Nice feeling of the rubber, feeling of all your fingers and your thumb pressure on the grip so that you have a nice, smooth, back and forth opportunity to swing this club as easily as you can and make the best golf swing and the best swing motion to pick up this ball and send it where you'd like to go. Okay, again, Make sure you, you, look, you look at where you'd like to see the ball be delivered. You put the club head in that direction correctly. As you can see here, I'm, 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 a, I'm open. I, I, I am at a degree open, and I get full exposure of my target in front of me, both from the center, left, or right side. Hands on the club, set up inside here, get comfortable, start my back swing, move my forward swing, and I create the best uh, motion that I can to get good contact and good launch. So we'll do that again. Look at my target, feel where I'd like to have the ball go to, set my face, put my hands comfortably on the club, feel my, my ball position here, and then I just let myself create the best golf swing that I can put on it. And I don't have time to think. All I've got to do time is to give myself the smoothest easiest swing motion that I can produce. That's a wrap on another Lessons with Dan. Go to thevillagegolfclub.com and sign up to get notified when the next lesson comes out.